Good afternoon guys, happy, what is today, Tuesday, when, Monday, Monday to all of your sunshiny faces. Guys, I am super happy. I told you guys how I have been slowly chipping away, getting things done, um, like in my room, kind of cleaned up back to how they need to be and everything like that. And today I ended up getting my desk taken care of and somewhat cleaned off. As of right now, this is <laughs> what is clean. Um, this is still a little bit of a cluttery mess over here. Um, and mainly I just need to get these candles actually put away. I need to figure out somewhere to put this Lego stuff too that I made, um, which I might wind up putting up here maybe. Um, but my Christmas tree, my little Christmas tree from Christmas is still in here. Um, so like I said, I think I need to, um, clean that off, but I don't want to put it up there though, because my printer is up there. I'm trying to figure out somewhere that I can keep it. I don't know. Maybe I could even keep it there. I don't know if that's too tall though. Um, if I can put it up there, um, and maybe just like clear off or move some of this stuff. That's really just a shelf of like decoratives and that actually needs to go back in my, um, my underneath my bed. I have a little box full of like scented, like holiday scented things. Um, <laughs> so that, um, you know, because I can't put them up in the attic with like Christmas decor a lot of times just because, um, you know, or holiday decor, I guess, because sometimes the wax might wind up melting. Um, if it gets like way, way, way too hot, um, which has been a problem in a couple cases, but, um, you know, I just don't want that to happen. Plus too, I have like wax melts and stuff like that, that obviously if it does get hot enough in the attic could melt. So, um, I don't want to leave any of that stuff up there. So I need to put that away. And like I said, maybe I can put it up there. Um, but for the most part, my desk is a little bit cleaner than it was. I need to actually just write the dates on these and put these in my little, um, insert bin. This is actually my planner from last year. Um, and I need to get that, um, switched out with the new one. I got this for Christmas and I actually just put it to today, which is the correct date on there. Um, and that is like my Christmas scented candle too, or maybe it's not, it's just an apple scented one, but I was kind of burning it for like fall. My desk has been such a mess since pretty much like November. <laughs> um, almost all of December, it was just a disaster. So I haven't really burned anything else, but I was like, yes, I want to break out some of these candles that I got for Christmas and stuff. So, um, yeah, like I said, guys, that is my desk a little bit cleaner than it was, you know, is good. So, um, I've told you guys I've been working like every day to try and get something in my room done and taken care of. I got all of my bedding washed pretty much. Um, and then I ended up cleaning my carpet yesterday. Like, not deep cleaning my carpet, but really going in and trying to like really vacuum it up and stuff like that, which I told you guys took me a, a good bit of time to do that yesterday. Plus I ended up getting to something else that I don't remember. Um, but I did that and then like I said today, went through kind of just decluttered my desk. And again, I do have to still put some things away and figure out where some stuff needs to go and things like that. But um, for the most part, it is a little bit better than it was at least, which is good. Now I have this gigantic mound of, <laughs> of all of my, um, clothes that I need to get put away. But I maybe was mentioning to you guys, I think I want to try and keep my dresses and maybe my jumpers like up in the attic. Um, just because those are things that for one, those are more summer, just, you know, like only summer. And I only really tend to wear them if we're going somewhere that's a little bit nicer, um, you know, or some type of like party or outing or something like that. Normally I will know that ahead of time. So I don't need to, you know, it's not like my everyday clothing if I'm going to wear a dress or something like that. Um, only because I tend to, especially again in the summer when I feel like I wear dresses more anyway, um, like I might wind up, <clears throat> excuse me guys, out in the garden. So that's why I would prefer to wear shorts, even if like they're just like jean shorts, which I normally don't wear. I still normally end up wearing like athletic shorts, which I work in the garden with anyway. And it's more comfortable. And because, um, again, that's normally, you know, when you get hot and stuff like that, like I don't want to be wearing like a dress that is like uncomfortable or I can't like sit like comfortably into, you know, if I'm just like chilling and stuff like that, um, you know, or whatever. So like even too, sometimes when I'm sitting in my desk chair, like I'll pull like my legs up underneath myself, you know, or sit with them, my legs like off to the side or whatever. I like to sit on my knees a lot for some reason. Um, like not on my knees, but like sit with my feet underneath me. And so I feel like you can't do that appropriately in a dress. <laughs> um, so that's why like, you know, or it's just like, not like, you know, 
like I don't know I can't get comfortable in it either um so that's why I I don't like to wear those kind of things in the summer unless like I know like okay I'm specifically going out to a party and I'm gonna do this or you know like I do really feel like dressing up tomorrow or so, you know something for whatever um so those type of things I want to keep in the attic just because they're not something I wear every day and I feel like I don't need it to have it in my closet along with some of my like jackets as well because I do have a couple of like extra jackets I have my normal like winter jacket I also have my North Face, which I normally wind up wearing those. Like, I just wore my North Face to go to the grocery store because I was wearing more of, like, I was wearing athletic leggings instead of wearing, like, my winter jacket just because I feel like it's more, like, athletic sort of anyway. So you can kind of add those two things together and it looks a little bit better than, like, athletic leggings. I'm wearing, like, a nice, like, and it's not, like, a puffy jacket. It's more of, like, a nice, like, winter jacket, if that makes sense. So that's why, um... Again, I, I wear those sometimes interchangeably, but um, I those two would probably be the two that I would keep down. And then I have a couple of extra ones that's like a really nice fancy like lace one. And it's not even a winter jacket. It's more of just kind of like, like I'd probably wear it more in like fall um, more than anything else. And um, it's like, I mean, it's like layered, but it's like a really nice like lace jacket um that I actually have like folded up on the hanger because I can't hang it all the way down because I don't have room <laughs> because I have two shelves in my closet and then the same thing with some of my dresses too so I feel like I could utilize the space a little bit better if I was able to store a couple of things up in the attic because we do have like um what's it called like hooks up in the not hooks but like a actual like rod up in the attic um where my dad keeps some of his nicer clothes as well or things that again he doesn't wear normally um so most of his most of his hanging clothes he keeps up there because he has like a little spot in my, the closet but my parents closet is as big as my closet is as well and there's two of them obviously <laughs> and so um my dad normally doesn't wind up like like I said some of his nicer clothes I think he keeps up in the attic um so anyways though like I said I was just like trying to figure out some of the stuff that I can like utilize that space maybe a little bit more in my closet um and so I want to do that but I'm again having to go through that stuff and then put this away because I did get a lot of stuff for my cousin plus two I do want to purge and kind of go through some of my stuff in my closet as well and be like do I wear this can I get rid of it do I want it you know that kind of thing um and just see too like what type of clothes have I been gravitating toward like, there's stuff that I've been wearing more recently and so that's the type of stuff that I probably will wind up keeping you know if there's something I'm like I clearly have not worn this in like two or three years um you know I need to get rid of it which I just did maybe I think it was about last year I think I went through it right around my birthday or right before my birthday last year I think it was um, I can't remember if it was that or the year before, but I do know I went through pretty recently. Um, or maybe it was last spring actually when my cousin gave me clothes in the spring. So, like I said, I just went through it not too long ago, but there's, again, some stuff that I probably, now that it's been a whole nother season and we went through all of summer and now we've gone through part of winter and I can see like I haven't worn this or I have wore this um you know and that kind of thing and then figure out like I can get rid of this or you know whatever so that's what I'm thinking I'm going to do maybe if I can get the chance to tomorrow it's actually 11:30 right now I'm gonna get to bed guys because I stayed up to watch the national championship game and now I am going to go to bed and go to bed early, guys, because I didn't wake up super early today and I was kind of bummed about that. So I feel like if I do get up, that would be great. And then also, too, I'm going to start cleaning the rooms of the house tomorrow, most likely, if everybody has all their stuff picked up. So, again, do the deep cleaning in the bathroom just because over the holidays, it totally got away from me. Um, like again it, they've been somewhat cleaned but not like really deep cleaned um you know like the toilet gets cleaned out the sink gets wiped down you know that kind of stuff but the shower will kind of just clean off or we'll use like after shower spray stuff to do in there just so that like you don't get like mold and mildew and all that um but yeah it hasn't been really like clean cleaned scrubbed you know like deep clean sort of in probably most of like since the holidays really um so I'm gonna hopefully be able to get back to that tomorrow but I need to get to bed so I'll see you guys all in tomorrow's vlog if you guys did enjoy today's make sure you guys give a big old thumbs up if you guys are new we'd love if you'd subscribe and I'll see all of your sunshiny faces tomorrow so bye guys